Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the Eldridge Fam. If you're new here, welcome to the Eldridge Fam. Yay! You want to go get the egg? Yay! We got to let the ducks out this morning. Hi, Sean. Hi, Sean. Oh, hi. <laughs> Maverick, it's your ducks. <laughs> Say hi. Say good morning, ducks. Maverick loves seeing them fly. He always tries to chase them until they, they fly. <laughs> okay, come here, bud. Oh, look, here comes Mama. I didn't know Mama was coming. Bye-bye. <laughs> so, as you guys know, we just had brand new twin boys. And Maverick has missed being outside. And so we are trying to get him outside every chance we get. And he is just, he loves it. As you guys can see, he loves it. Hi, Marsh. I didn't know you were coming out to be with me. Yeah. It's a little cold. Well, it's a little colder than I thought. I'm a little colder than I thought. <laughs> yeah. It's like 55 degrees, you guys, but it feels a lot colder than that. Mav, Zan's coming to say hi. Oh, here comes Zan. He heard us outside. He missed us outside, yeah. too. Yeah, Zan misses us out here. He loves it. Bike. Bike? Yeah. Your bike is over there. You guys, Maverick is getting so good on his bike. Go get it. Go get it. Rap, 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 rap. Whoa, you almost crashed into mama. Yeah, I think we should set up the seat and the handlebars a little bit so he yeah, can use his legs. Go more. up one level. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, did you slide in the mud? <laughs> oh, your handlebars get stuck, huh? Yeah, why did you do that? <sighs> I don't know. I think they just have dirt right there. Maybe. Like dirt in Okay, let's go. Come on, come on. <laughs> so we are currently collecting eggs. Um, Marcy's sister, and brother, and sister-in-law, um, we give a lot of our eggs to them. But we're actually holding back the best eggs that we can find because we we're gonna. Them to try them. <laughs> yeah, because we don't want them to have them. No, because we are actually going to hatch some new chicks. So we've got um, a couple of the other homesteading YouTube channels that we're friends with um, that have been getting their chickens killed by raccoons, and we want some more chickens. Um, and so we're gonna try hatching a bunch of these eggs if we can get that to work. I see four eggs. One, two, three, four. Egg. Okay. Yes. I'm gonna give your, oh, here comes Zan. So this, this one looks like a really good egg. If I can get the straw off of it. So this is a good one, good size, good, pretty good shape. It's a little bit lopsided. This one's a little too small. And I think both of these are probably good. So they're a little bit bigger. They have a good shape, like pretty just uniform. I don't really know what I'm talking about, but I just assume that the healthier looking the egg, the healthier looking chicken will get, if that makes sense. That's what we're gonna go with anyways. I think we're gonna incubate probably 50 eggs. And yeah, cause you don't know how many are actually gonna hatch. You know, cause like when we did our quail, we had, over a hundred eggs, I think, and we ended up with 40 birds. Um, and that was my first time ever incubating. So hopefully we do a little bit better. Are we really gonna walk down to the pond? Yeah, I, we need to get him. Maverick, come back over here, please. Go, 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 go faster, faster. Yeah, see his knees are a little too bent. I think he could go faster if he, uh, if we raise it up. Woohoo! Which is crazy because we got him this for Easter last year. So it's been Woo. like, nine months yeah, actually it's been seven and a half months because we just found out we were pregnant and we've just had our babies and i he couldn't even sit on it it's yeah. so crazy to me 
Yeah, no, it's crazy how good he's gotten so quick. Look at all the chickens, you guys. Everybody's doing pretty dang good. How many roosters do we have? We only have two roosters. We have two Wee. roosters and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Wee. nine. Wee. I think we're missing a couple of hens. Um, it's weird. Our chickens seem to like group up. So we'll have like a group of nine or ten and then a group of four or five. And they kind of all go off and do their own things every day. So I think we're missing one of the groups of like four or five or two or three. And or five or two or three. Or I don't know how many. We don't really know exactly how many chickens we have right now. Uh, but I think we have like 15. So my guess is, Mars, there there's two or three hens right now that are off laying eggs somewhere else. Not in, Not in the coop. So, I mean, we still are getting six, seven eggs a day. So... But we were at two weeks ago, we were getting nine to 11 eggs a day. Yeah, we were getting like 10 a day. So, but it has dropped in temperature. So, I wonder if that could the have daylight's been. gotten shorter. Yeah, everything's kind of changed a little bit. Man, Maverick just loves it out here, you guys. And the grass is all I short enough he can too. ride it. What? Yeah, I just feel like ever since having the babies, like I just want to be outside. Maybe it's because I have to be inside now. And so, <laughs> so now you, now <laughs> now you want to be out. <laughs> and the weather changed. Like it, the weather was so hot this last summer that like going outside was miserable. And then the last three weeks we've had quite a bit of rain. So yeah, now it's like it's finally nice. Well, today it's kind of cold. If pregnancy but. gets you to like going outside, Mars, that is the best thing ever. The one, could you imagine I switch out Mexican food for going outside? Oh my gosh. <laughs> so if you guys didn't know, when Marcy got pregnant with Maverick, or up yeah. in, up until she got pregnant with Maverick, she did not like Mexican food at all. Like, just did not like it. She got pregnant with Mar Maverick, and that's all we would eat. Yeah, we didn't have, we haven't found, like, a great place we like here, though. So we didn't have it very much. We didn't, yeah, we didn't have it very much this pregnancy, but she still likes it. Like, we still eat it and stuff like that. So... That was like one of the best things that came from Maverick's pregnancy. So if besides outside, <laughs> well, yeah, besides it. But if from this pregnancy, it's wanting to go outside more, that's good because she's got three boys now. And if they're anything like Maverick, the only thing they want to do is be outside. Man, or so, Kendall. Or guys, me. The or only me. Thing the only thing I want to do is, is be outside. outside. Or if he's not outside, he wants to watch videos of people being outside. Or what, look at pictures of things outside that's pretty true <laughs> i love it out here it's just so nice all of the animals you guys are doing good from us being gone when we were at the hospital everybody's just loving it there's a lot of fresh green grass and clover that's coming up in the fields we do have an armadillo problem yeah we do have an armadillo problem i don't know if you guys can see like all, like all of the rooting around so we may try and catch the armadillo I don't really care if they're back here doing it, but they get into the front yard and they just rip up the flower beds and the grass and everything. Or even where we've planted all the grass up by the house. Yeah. So the armadillos are sometimes a pain in the butt. Should we go look at the quail? Let's go look at the quail. We haven't been getting any quail eggs, which I'm not surprised because of the daylight. I'm honestly surprised we've been getting so many chicken eggs, um, but... I don't think we'll get very many today because it's darker. Yeah, that could be true. It'll be shorter. Yeah, guys, look at the armadillo digging all so around the quail. So is it trying to get in to get the quail? I don't, I don't think armadillos eat quail. They eat like bugs. Let's see. Oh, there is an egg over there. How do you get them? Oh, there's, guys, there's like four eggs. Man, come look at the eggs. I see one, two, three, three eggs, you guys. Four. Four eggs. Man, they blend into these wood shavings so good that I can't even really see them. All right, I'm going to hand the camera. We need a, we need one of those kitty litter scoops to, like, go through and kitty litter scoop out the Are eggs. Is dinosaur? Yeah. Here, Mars, will you hold the... Remember, I just put these eggs in your pocket, Mars. One time? The other day, <laughs> I forgot I had quail eggs in my pocket, and I, like, went and started working, and they all got smashed, and I just had egg running down my <laughs> pants and stuff. Oh my gosh, here's another one. Holy cow. Yeah, come eat the eggs. I checked this yesterday and there was none. Oh. Sorry, you guys. No wonder why he always comes inside the house stinking. Not always, but. Okay, are we missing any? Well, I mean, maybe the ones you're sitting on.
have the quilt? Please. What month did we hatch them? August. 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 <laughs> did you guys hear that? I said August. Okay. Can Daddy hold it and you go ride your bike? Mm. Hey guys, that's sweet. I'm excited. Five more quail eggs. I would love to hatch these, but I don't know how long they've been in there. So my guess is they probably they may have frozen. Although we haven't had it freeze for no, it a hasn't couple of weeks, huh? Frozen the last four days. So maybe we'll uh, try to hatch them. Maybe we'll throw these in the incubator with the uh, chicken eggs. I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe we'll just. Uh, her uh, brother and sister-in-law, their kids love eating the they quail eggs. They say they're quail, so. they like the quail eggs more than the chicken eggs. We haven't given them any duck eggs. Yeah. Which, our duck is sitting on eggs, and we might have a Christmas surprise uh, if all goes well with that. She's uh, she's dedicated to it, though. She has been sitting on them uh, know, for like two weeks now. I was going to say, I haven't seen her in weeks. Yeah, she comes out once or twice a day, gets a bunch of food, um, but... Yeah, well, I think we're going to have baby ducks here soon, which is fun. Because a lot of the other channels want some of our ducks. So, those are the ducks that we got from Marie over at Twisted Bee Minis. Um, if you guys haven't checked out her channel, she's got some of the coolest animals. Go check her out for sure. Um, but once they hatch, we're going to figure out what we're going to do with them. We kind of didn't know she was sitting I, on eggs until we went out there and she was sitting on eggs. Yeah. And there's like 15 or 20 of them. So, yesterday when she was out of the cage, Mars, I tried to see... a how many eggs there were and like if there were any chicken eggs in there but she had covered them up with feathers when she left oh no so i couldn't way. even see yeah without which I thought like was, touching them yeah which was really cool i thought there's a bunch of things i need to do i've got to get the roof put on the duck cage i've got to replace this water spigot as you guys can see it is leaking which is kind of nice because the ducks and the chickens always have water uh right here <laughs> yeah but I do need to get that fixed, especially before it starts really freezing. Oh my gosh, that Otherwise, we're going to be screwed. Yeah. Well, and the, the it'll freeze and then crack and then we'll have a bigger leak. Egg. Yeah, Daddy got the eggs. Dad. Where's your brothers? Uh, are they inside? What are their names? Harvey. Harvey and? and? <laughs> no, Paxton. Santa. Santa. Yeah. Harvey and Santa. <laughs> Paxton's a little hard for him to say. And he'll say it occasionally, but it is a lot harder. And we didn't, Harvey, we've been practicing with him since. Yeah, he, for we knew months. Harvey for a long time, yeah. So we didn't know Paxton, as you guys know, until like three days before they were born. At first, I was mad that Colonel put that dirt bike track right there because I was like, we have an entire yard and you stick it right here. But it's nice that like I can stand at the back door and watch him. Yeah, it's like right, yeah, it's just right here. Not that he cares. He just goes, goes, goes. So the chickens have their own food. Oh! Good job, Sean. Uh, you got to turn off the wings when you land. I didn't know Sean could fly that well. That's about as good as he can fly. <laughs> so the chickens have their own feed, you guys. But for some reason, they feel the need every day. Okay, that chicken just came out of the shed. I've got to go search the shed for eggs because I think there's eggs in there. Uh, but the chickens have their own feed in their chicken coop. It's the exact same type of food. And here they are just stealing all of the duck's food. You guys, are you kidding me? You have your own food. Why do you have to be in here stealing the duck's food? If you guys look at the duck water, see how it's like foggy? The ducks this morning, I literally just cleaned that out and I'm going to clean it out again. But they literally... Um, eat food or they fill their mouth up with food and then they go get it wet in the water and so it just feels like it fills with food that's why it's that almost the same color as the food because they dip their water in their food or their food in their water let's look Mars see if we can find some more eggs in here oh yeah Mars is scared of this place you guys look at this I just found an egg on this shelf I knew there was probably one in here laying somewhere there's literally an egg just sitting on the shelf. I have no idea how old that is. We may not eat that one. No. Just because we don't want to get sick. Whoa. There's no point in. Uh, it's probably okay. But we're going to just go without eating it. So only one egg in there. Which is good I guess. I can't believe there was an egg in there though. No. Here it is. 
They didn't just light it. I don't think so. I don't know how old it is. Maybe we'll just incubate it. We'll throw it in the incubate pile. Because I don't know if I'd eat it. <laughs> it probably isn't that old, though. You should, like, mark it with an X so we know that one was the one we found. That's a good and idea. And see if it, like, if it follow along on our journey of our mystery egg. Our mystery egg. <laughs> Maverick's having so much fun out here. He is. <laughs> I'm excited. This sounds so weird. I feel like a different person. I was going to say, I'm excited to, like, get things a little cleaned up. Like, oh, I know. There's so much stuff everywhere because we've got like 15 million projects going on at the same time. Well, and not even that, but like we don't have a like community dump, county dump. Yeah. So we don't have a county dump. So we have like all of this stuff that like we can't take to the dump. I've still got to, yeah, find like, a place to put it. And... But yeah. Yeah, we've got a lot of cleanup to do, but. I think we both are just at the point of like, okay, the babies are here. I feel like we can like do stuff, now. do stuff now. Yeah, like it's just been like getting stuff ready, stressing about it, and now that they're here, it's I feel like we can now in a do way the it's things less that we've stressful. Neglected yeah, a little bit. yeah, or like the babies are done, they're taken care of. Like now, let's go do something else. Yeah, and we get we're gonna have to continue to take care of our babies, and that's not done. But like. Our focus has been getting their room ready, like, getting our house to where it's been livable. Which, actually, we have a freaking awesome video coming out. Probably on Saturday. So, our next video. Yeah, our next video. Yeah, is going to be plan. major house stuff. Major yeah. house stuff. And it's something you have all asked for. Like, and when I Mars say you all... begged for it, and every single one of you begged for it. So, it's I finally been... listened. My procrastination is coming to an end. Thanks yes. to someone else. Yes, so we're super, super grateful, and I'm really excited for this next video. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was a little bit different. We're going to go show you the babies real quick, but hopefully you guys enjoyed it, seeing around the farm a little bit, especially because a lot of you guys are new to the channel. This is us. This is our homestead, our farm, our house. This is the property we're building from the ground up. Yeah. And if you are new, um, I'm Marcy, this is Crandall, and our little boy's Maverick, and then we'll show you the twins. Harvey and Paxton. Let's go see them. These are the eggs that we've got, and you can put those all in there. We need to wash you off a couple of them. You a poopy egg in my pocket. Yes. Because we don't want to wash it if uh, if they're going to be incubated. Okay, so these... Or eaten. Or eaten. Or, yeah, until they're going to be refrigerated. Once you wash an egg, it has to be refrigerated. These aren't all refrigerated. So... Uh, these are the ones that I've pulled out so far that we're going to incubate. So I'm actually going to move them to this tray because we've got more that we're going to incubate. Um, but yeah, these are oh, like need, three um, days worth of eggs. We need the eggs for them to take home. Yeah. These eggs are the ones we'll send with them. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You love the eggs, huh? Okay. Maverick's a pretty good helper. He's only ever broke one egg. Yep. And I think it was, he set it on the counter and it and rolled. It rolled. Yeah. Huh, are you the best helper? So these chickens, I we should have said this while we were outside. These are American breast chickens, and um, they are dual purpose meat egg layer birds, and we're really excited about them. Um, they don't lay big, big eggs, but they lay a lot of them. So, and then not only that, but you can obviously harvest the chicken. So. That's pretty exciting. Okay, so there's a dozen and a half that are going to go in the incubator. We're going to wait for probably three more days, and we'll fill this tray up, and maybe, I think it's 28 days. So it's going to be a little while. Yeah, I guess so. Wow. Holy crap, these will be 2023 chickens. Okay, put it in, Matt. Our right first here. hatching. Good job. Okay, no, all done. Thank Before you. you two um, are done in here, you need to wash your hands because of the eggs and your brothers. Okay. Yeah. Let's go see your brothers, bud. Baby. Girl, you could tell it was him in the back of his head. Yeah, I'm doing good, you guys. I'm figuring baby. it out. Ah, baby. How did you get that open? No, it was mine from last night. It was sitting on the counter, but it was in the package, so I thought he would think it was closed. Yeah, I thought it was closed. So Paxton's doing good, you guys. Oh, you sweet baby. 
Nobody's getting any sleep in this house. I but can't believe it's almost been a week. I know. It is. Tomorrow, it's, when this video comes out, it'll have been a week. Yeah. Holy cow. You're a week old, a week old week. man. Yeah. Can you give your brother a kiss? No, he doesn't eat cracker. Remember, he only eats milk. No cereal. No cereal, just oh, milk. Yeah. Never eat cereal. Mommy eats cereal. Daddy eats cereal. But babies only eat milk. Babies eat milk. Yeah. Let me show you guys Harvey. Yeah. Harvey. Harvey's our happy sleeper. So both of them are putting on weight, which we're obviously extremely excited about. But a lot of the, if you guys know newborns, they have really wrinkly, like their whole bodies are just really wrinkly and skinny. And they're starting to get rid of those wrinkles. They're starting to get rid of those wrinkles and start to put on weight. So thank goodness everybody's healthy. Maverick wants some cereal, y'all. So I'm going to end this video here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. We'll see you on the next one.